Hi, my name is Dr. Barukam. I'm about to perform a procedure called radio frequency ablation, which is for the treatment of Barrett's. My patient is Kathleen, who's a 59-year-old uh, female who initially came to see me in November 2011 for a screening colonoscopy. My name is Kathleen, and I'm here at Lapeer today. Dr. Baruchium diagnosed my Barrett's esophagus about a year ago when I came in for a routine colonoscopy. I told him I had heartburn, and so he did endoscopy at the same time, and at that time gave me the diagnosis. Traditionally, we screen these patients or monitor them uh, periodically uh, by doing biopsies. Now with this new treatment called radiofrequency ablation, uh, I saw her eight weeks ago here and uh, we went in and cauterized or ablated the area that uh, was uh, abnormal and uh, she's back here today for a second treatment. Uh, typically with what's called short segment Barrett's is what Kathleen has, one or two treatments uh, can uh, eliminate the problem. So we're about to start the procedure now, so uh, follow me. We're just about getting started on the procedure, and her esophagus looks much improved after one therapy. Great results. And we're back in the stomach. Retroflex view, everything looks great. So. Typically we should take biopsies of the esophagus to diagnose Barrett's, but now with this new brush biopsy that's called the uh, CDX Watts biopsy, it gives us a higher yield uh, than your standard biopsy. By scraping this area, any abnormal cells will get picked up, which is more accurate than biopsy alone by itself. And as you can see, there's a change in the tissue from where the ablation has occurred. Okay, now we're gonna scrape off the tissue that we just ablated to clean the surface. And there's absolutely no pain during this procedure. The patient's comfortable, they've received IV sedation, we finished the first round of ablation and we removed all the coagulum and now I'm doing another second round to make sure we've really covered all the area. So we finished with the procedure, Kathleen did great, I'm super happy with the results. The nurses here at Lapeer are really great and the staff is wonderful. If you've got chronic reflux, you should think about Barrett's and go get screened. And if you have been diagnosed with Barrett's, just be aware that there are treatment options other than just uh, surveillance and watching. The procedure itself took a little more than an hour. Afterwards, you may have a little bit of discomfort in your throat and down your esophagus. I'm ready to go home. I feel great.